New this morning, four-year-old Journey Coleman's death from a straight bullet touched many people across Birmingham and is inspiring one woman to push for change. CBS 42 News reporter Connie Gasky live in our digital newsroom this morning. So, Connie, this woman's goal is to help make public housing communities safer. It is. I spoke with Brandy McCollum. She's the one leading an effort to crack down on loitering and trespassing in public housing communities following Coleman's death. Coleman died Wednesday after being shot in the head. You're looking at video from the scene where this happened. It happened in the Marks Village public housing community on Sunday. Now McCollum wants to see tougher punishments for loitering and trespassing in public housing communities. These would include mandatory jail time. She got emotional when I asked her about why she's pushing for this. Children aren't safe anymore. I want to see the children be able to come out and play. You know, the, um, I'm sorry. To honor the memory of Jeremy. And she posted about what she wants to do and the changes she wants to make on Facebook. She's got a lot of support on Facebook for her ideas. I'll tell you more about how people are supporting her and her push for this change coming up in the next half hour. Live in the digital newsroom, Count and Gasquee, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.